Hi, my name is Tushar Patel. I'm a plastic and reconstructive surgeon. I also specialize in cosmetic surgery, and I'm here to answer your questions. So brow lift typically takes place in a surgical center, in an operating room. It can also be taking place in a hospital operating room as well. During the procedure, there is no pain as you would have general anesthesia for these procedures. So you'd be asleep and um, completely comfortable for these. It depends on the type of brow lift that's being performed. Most do require general anesthesia or at the very least IV sedation, almost like a twilight type of sleep to make them feel comfortable and so they're not moving their heads and foreheads while we're doing the surgery. Yeah, twilight is a IV sedation type of anesthetic. You don't have a breathing tube that goes in your mouth or in your throat, um, but you don't remember the surgery, don't feel any pain. Uh, you remember going to sleep and then just waking up but don't remember what happens between those two points. After the surgery, there will be some discomfort which is managed by oral medications. Um, patients are sore for about a couple days after which they switch over to a non-narcotic medication such as Tylenol Extra Strength and they seem to be pretty comfortable by about a week or so. By itself, depending on the technique that is used, can take anywhere between 45 minutes to an hour and a half. Oftentimes brow lifts are done in conjunction with other areas of facial rejuvenation such as upper and lower eye lifts and face lifts and neck lifts.